All right, so I just wanted to make this quick video. It say Kanye wants us to pay 200 for Don. And if y'all do y'all research and y'all look it up, a lot of people saying like, oh, Kanye tripping. He wants to pay 200 for an album, blah, 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 all this shit. But these the same people who was like, Nipsey was tripping when he wanted niggas to pay 100. And guess what? Niggas bought that hundred dollar album. Jay Z even bought some. And then he Nipsey came back out with the with the thousand dollar album. Motherfuckers bought that too. So before y'all shit on Kanye, just know people gonna pay that two hundred. You may not pay it, but people gonna pay that motherfucking two hundred because they did it for for Nipsey. They paid a hundred for Nipsey, and then they paid. 800 more than 200, which is a thousand for, for the thousand dollar album Nipsey sold. And Nipsey is a way more smaller artist on the scale of like celebrity. You know what I'm saying? Kanye is bigger than Nipsey. He's been out longer than Nipsey. He sold more records than Nipsey. And this ain't no disrespect to Nipsey. I'm just putting putting everything into, into perspective for y'all. And I'm trying to make sure y'all understand Kanye is like apist. He's with a Kardashian or was with a Kardashian. He has a family, family ties with Kardashians. He's been on reality TV. He's been on a couple episodes of Keeping Up with the Kardashians. He's a superstar, an icon. <coughs> Excuse me. He's a superstar and an icon. So thinking. His diehard fan base ain't gonna pay that 200 for Donda, too. Y'all gotta be out y'all mind. Cause Nipsey's diehard fans paid that hundred dollars for his hundred his hundred dollar album, and then they paid that thousand for his thousand dollar album. And um, Nipsey's fan base was way smaller back then. Like, think about it. Nipsey's when Nipsey did that hundred dollar album. That was before, way before he passed away. Because he was the biggest he ever been when he died, unfortunately. You know, motherfuckers gave him a Grammy, if I'm not mistaken. He was nominated before he passed, though. So he was at least nominated for one. Meanwhile, Kanye got like, I think Kanye got like three Grammys or some shit like that, 20 something Grammys. So, uh, or probably more, I don't know. Um, this video is all freestyle, by the way, but I'm just trying to put stuff into perspective for y'all. Like I said, um, motherfuckers are gonna buy that two hundred dollar album because they bought Nipsey's hundred dollar album, and if they bought a thousand dollar album, you know they're gonna buy a two hundred dollar album. Not saying they got the same fan base, but I'm pretty sure a lot of people that love Nipsey love Kanye, and a lot of people that love Kanye love Nipsey. I have a sticker on the back of my laptop of Kanye and Nipsey, so that's my opinion on it, man. Shout out to Kanye, $200 for an album. I'm pretty sure most of that money gonna go to him, if not all of it. I'm pretty most of it probably gonna go to him. Um, I can't wait to hear it. Hopefully he um puts it on all streaming platforms too. Like Nipsey, he sold the album for 100, but he also put it everywhere. So if you didn't have that 100 or if you didn't want to pay that 100, you can still get it in other ways. I hope Kanye do it like that too, because I want to at least test the product before I buy it. You know, I love Down to One. So if it's anything like Down to One, which I'm pretty sure it's not, but if it is like Down to One, I would definitely um, buy it. But that's just my opinion, man. I, like I said, I'm not here to really talk your heads off. I just want everybody to think, I just want everybody to know that if you think people ain't going to buy this $200 album from an icon, a legend, a goat like Kanye, they bought Nipsey's for 1000 And Nipsey wasn't as popular or as famous as Kanye. At the time, Nipsey sold a $100 album and a $1,000 album. And this is no shot to Nipsey. Like I said, I'm just trying to let y'all, I'm trying to trying to put things into perspective. That's the word of the day, pers perspective. My dog is barking in the background. His car is outside. He can hear him. But yeah, like I said, we just 
putting stuff into perspective, man. Well, I'm just trying to put stuff into perspective. If they bought Nipsey's album, they gonna buy Kanye's for sure. Trust me. 